Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling. And today, I got an unboxing and a review of... Chai, I've been looking... Well, not looking. Trying to order from these folks for forever. And I finally was able to do it. So, let me get situated here. Make sure my camera is on for you guys. So I got three hats from Ruslan Baginski. If you guys did not know, I have been trying to order these hats for years. The issue was my bank would not allow me to order. So when I started seeing all the girls getting it, I'm like, how are they getting it? And I know there's an issue with ordering from the Ukraine. So I noticed that they were all getting it from like other websites that were US, US based. So... I was like, you know what? I'm not even going to do it because I wanted to get an extra large. And the hats that they had here, I just, it wasn't the ones that I actually wanted. Well, anyway, I tried it recently. What I had to do, and no one talks about this, I had to go through a third party app, if that makes sense. So I had to use Klarna, and then I used a card from Klarna, and I used it on PayPal, if that makes sense. My bank was like, ah, no, you cannot use your card, period, <laughs> in the Ukraine. So that was my way of getting around it just so I can get the hats. And of course, you know, Klarna just takes the money out. So I just paid like right off as soon as everything kind of registered in the app. So that's the first part about it. The other thing is when you get your package, <sighs> you guys already know how I feel about packaging. It just comes in a box. And then the bag was in the box and the hats were just wrapped in like tissue paper. And I was like, these hats are not cheap. So I think you guys could have did a better job, but the hats were not damaged at all. I've said this before, ordering from Lack of Color is really, really good because Lack of Color put their hats in a hat box so they're never smashed. Brixton on the other hand, it's a no-go. Um, but let's just get into the hats and then I'll get into the sizing when I put the hats on. So I got three different hats and I'll show you all three at one time and then go into them. Ah, three different hats, guys. If you know my wardrobe, if you've been following me, I have a lot of neutral colors, but red is my pop of color. It is my favorite color. I don't have a ton of it, but I do have pops of red. So two of the hats I did get in, in a large and then the other one I got in the extra large. I have two more coming that are extra larges and this is why I wanted to order from them is solely because they have extra large. I do not see the extra larges here in the US. So I got them from there. The last part that I wanted to talk about before I try the hats on is the taxes. This might bite me in the tushy later. I'm trying to figure out the taxes part because when you get the actual invoice, it just tells you that the receivable pay the duty and taxes. I don't know what to do at this point. I've been doing some research. I don't see anything. This is just saying subtotal value 135. Um, unit. I don't like. I don't know what they're trying to say here. So once I figure that part out, I am gonna edit the description and put all of that in there for you guys. But as of right now, this does say that. I have to pay for it um, so let's get into the hats and then the sizing when you are measuring your head for these hats they recommend you using a flexible tape which I've said this is a closet essential in one of my other videos you need this girls like even if you're ordering wigs and stuff you need this so you would pretty much take this and start at the center of your forehead and then go around to <laughs> hold on <laughs> you would go around uh oh to the center here and then you you know cross it and then you get your measurements mine is saying 24 now if you have gone on their website my hair is sticking up if you have gone on their website and check their sizing it is going to tell you that an extra large is a 23.2, a large is a 22.8. So 
So I just said my head was 24, right? So <laughs> the reason why I wanted to try both sizes was because I wanted to see how the hats would fit with a unit on. And for those of you girls and guys who don't know what a unit is, it's a wig, okay? Uh, some girls wear really high density units that are like 180. Shoot, I haven't seen somebody say they had a 200 density wig. That is thick. Um, but if you wear like a 150, you will be okay with a large. Um, if you do wear your hair in like maybe like a short haircut or your hair in like a doobie as what we call it in New York, um, you will be fine with even a medium uh, to be quite honest. So I'm going to try on this one first. This one was a little expensive because I think it's because it's straw. Now, what I noticed about the straw hat is that it's straw. It's not sprayed. It wasn't like a light color and they sprayed it. It's just a straw hat. Really, really nice. You got the RB right there, the little X, which is the other signature part. Um, and this is a large. So let me show you guys how this fit. I'm gonna just prop it up. All right. I'm gonna show you guys <laughs> my ear, for example. Here's my ear, and this is the hat. It's right here. And I'm showing you that for a reason because the large and the extra large pretty much sit at, at the exact same place. So that's not where the the size it's going when it comes to like it being larger. It's more so with this. Um, but I'm gonna turn just a little bit so you guys can see the back. It's sitting where it's supposed to sit on my head, which is at the largest part of my head, if that makes sense. Um, but absolutely love it. This, girls, is gonna be my spring and summer hat. I just can't, I have a ton of stuff in my closet that is neutral colors. I prefer the darker color uh, straw hat because of my wardrobe, wardrobe and my skin tone. So this is the first hat. Let me know what you guys think. I'm just gonna come a little closer so you guys can see everything. I hope you guys can see everything because I'm actually sitting. Okay, let's go top. Really nice. Now the price went up on their hats. And I'll tell you guys how I noticed because I had them in my bucket, <laughs> my other bucket. And um, the price changed, honey. So here's the other hat in the large. This, you really can't see. And this is the cotton one. The cotton one kind of feels like I don't know, like a denim shirt kind of, but this is more of like a taupe color. You can't really see the color on camera, but I got this one. I didn't want a black tip on this one for a reason. Um, when, you, when you're shopping for things, girls, like think about your wardrobe and I like to have multiple of things because you never know what you're gonna wear, how you're gonna wear it. So I wanted this one. And I also want one that has a dark brim and a lighter top. And that's just because some days I may just want to be strictly monochrome with no other color. And then some days I may want to have a black brim. So this is also a large and this is the cotton one. Okay. And again, they it fits the same way. You're going to see the large on my head, um, the extra large on my head and how it sits. And you guys, I'm looking here because my mirror is here. You guys tell me what you think, and I'll show you the difference when I put the other one on. To me, it's just a little bigger here. Um, and you know, it sits up a bit on the head. That's the um the paper. But this is nice as well. Alright, so this hat was two 270. Okay, <laughs> my hair's sticking up. <laughs> this hat was $270. Uh, the price on these, I mean, not the price, the size on this is a large. Uh, like I said, it's like more of a taupe color, but you can't really see it on camera here. 
but it's a really, 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 really nice hat. Okay. Right now on their website, everything looks like it's available, meaning all sizes. So it looks like there's a nine day shipping. I actually got these pretty fast. I was surprised. I thought they were going to be, I was supposed to get them on Tuesday when this video goes up, but I actually got them on Thursday. So I don't know if it's the DHL, it's just good shipping, but you know, I got them pretty, pretty fast. So that's the second hat. And these hats don't really have like the name on, like no real naming on them. <laughs> um, and I was double checking to make sure I gave you guys everything. Like this just says monogram embellished baker. So does the straw one. And then this last one I'll show you guys, which is the extra large. And it just says red on it. Okay. Now this is the extra large. I do have a black or leather one coming because that one is super dope. And I got that in an extra large because she told me that it was, they emailed me and said it was available. So I was like, oh, yay. Like it's been months. So the difference between these hats is the straw one and the other one. I have to like push it down. This one kind of slides right on. And it's because of this unit, guys. If I didn't have a, this fluffy hair on, it would slide right on with my natural hair, with even maybe even a straighter wig possibly, but this has a lot of volume in it. But the red one is cool. And it, again, it sits exactly at the same place as the other hats. So that's not where the extra sizing is going. It's going to to the width of the hat, if that makes sense. Um, because it slides down just a little bit easier. But the position of the hat, it still sits exactly the exact same place. I hope that is making sense for you guys. So it may feel a little weird that your ear is down, but that's just the way the hat is. Now I could return these two and get an extra large. I don't know, I don't know how I could. I don't know how long that's going to take. So if I do, I will let you guys know. If not, they're just going to stay in my closets, okay? But this is it. This is just a quick unboxing of the Ruslan Baginski hats. They are back in stock, guys. The price did go up. So any hat that was $220 is now $250 or $260. Um, so they did increase in price, and it's probably because everything is like back in stock on the website so that is it that's all i wanted to show you guys today a quick unboxing packaging was mediocre um shipment was great it was quicker than i expected none of the hats were damaged price is increased um so that's not a good thing uh, but they're really nice so this is the wool version this is a cotton version and here is the straw version um so that's it guys i want to thank you guys for tuning into this video if you have any questions about the hats let me know if you have anything about pack shipping pricing all that good stuff please let me know in the comments and i will definitely get to your comment um but thank you guys for tuning in if you stay to the end of this video please comment coco we see you and guys don't forget to follow me on instagram at coco styles nyc and coco styles ny and my personal style blog coco styles nyc and my style services coco styles ny.com and i'm on tickety tickety talk for the moment because you guys know that they're trying to shut them down coco styles nyc and i will catch you guys in the next one bye guys